Hey, so a few years ago, a guy came through the Missing Link to give us a negotiation course. And I'm not going to tell you his name because uh, to quote him, albeit anonymously, you never want the world to know that you're a shrewd negotiator. But one of the things that he said to us, he said, the first rule of negotiation is to actually negotiate, to ask. And he says, most people don't win in negotiations because they don't realize they're in a negotiation. And in his mind, he says, you always are. Everything is negotiation to some degree. If you're in a debating price with somebody, you're always in a position where you should be negotiating. And that's what we want to talk about today. The weekend after the negotiation course, the guy had said to us, we had to negotiate something free. And I was uh, with Ross Drakes at a Europa Cafe in Sanson. We finished a meal and uh, Ross ordered a cappuccino and I said, could I have a red cappuccino please? He said, but I don't want to pay for it. And the waitress said, well, I can't help you. I said, well, uh, can I speak to your manager? And the manager came over and I said, listen, so here's the deal. Usually you would reward me uh, by coming to visit you 10 times uh, by giving me a free drink. And I said, well, what happens if you wanted to uh, do that in advance? Actually just reward me for my future visits. Now you're actually buying my uh, need to come back and, and to support the restaurant. And I said, and I think you could do that by giving me my free coffee now. And he laughed and he gave it to me. And the next day Ross was uh, walking with us through Hyde Park and um, he went up to a random place and said, hi, I'd like to have this apple, but I don't want to pay for it. And he said, sure, have it. And I realized just how much you can actually negotiate. Uh, the next week I negotiated fees with an estate agent and uh, I saved myself like about 50, 60,000 rand. And uh, I just think that sometimes we don't do it because we don't think it's available. And this leads me to what just happened today. So I'm in a hotel room right now in Hong Kong. I'm in the Marco Polo Hotel. And we've been walking around all day. We checked out this morning and we came back in. We were about to fly this evening. And we're just feeling like, oh, the last thing we want to do is just get onto an airplane. I wish we could shower. So we walked up to the front desk and said, hi there. Um, I was wondering if it was possible we could get a room. We've already checked out, but just so that we can shower before we travel. Now I travel a fair amount. I've been in, it's like my 20th country this year in the sixth continent or whatever. It's like a shit ton. But I've never thought to do that. I didn't think it was a thing. So usually you try to get a lounge, you pay for lounge access. And I asked for this and the guy said, oh, just a shower room for you. No problem at all. And five minutes later, we had a room to come and shower. This is a thing. It's a thing that you wish you knew, a thing that you wish you'd ask for, but you just don't. And it's amazing. And I guess my message is uh, to you this week is just ask for something you didn't know you could have. And it's amazing what happens when you ask. Remember, the first rule of negotiating is to negotiate. Stay curious. Peace. Hey, what's up? Thanks for watching. My name's Keegan. If you really dig this video, please hit like. Yo, if you want, yo. I always wanted to do one of these outros. Do you mind if I join you for this one? Oh, very bad. I thought this one was mine. Well, come on, bro. If you think about it, if we both do it, it'll be a lot better. Yeah, I got a good point there. Okay, well, let's hit it. Hey, what's up? I'm Keegan. And I'm Chris. Thanks for watching this video. If you dig the content that Rich is putting out every week, please hit like. Or subscribe if you're keen to see more of this rad content. Cheers. Sweet.